A new Salt Lake City memorial is in the works right now to honor a long-standing and beloved bird in town. Andy was a condor known by many, and sadly, he died in his sleep last summer. But now a man in Los Angeles is working on a life-size sculpture of the bird. And today's Eye on Utah, Amanda Gilbert shows us why Andy was so loved. The life-size memorial statue will do what Andy did, which is help us all fall in love with condors. The first thing you might notice at Tracy Aviary is the sounds, the songs of various birds. Birds that could literally stop you in your tracks, but one spot that's lost its noise. The king of the Andes exhibit. It's where Andy the condor lived. Andy. Keeper Helen Deshaw was by his side. This is his little man cave. Um, he would uh, sleep in there. Uh, he'd also go in there when it got hot. This is was his pond. Got great footage of him taking his baths in there. Uh, losing him literally felt like a part of me. Had died too, and uh, I miss him every day. In a place full of beauty, Andy proved it wasn't the feathers, the cute face, the mohawk, the looks that made him unforgettable. People say his quirkiness is why he deserves a poster. Absolutely. I mean, how could you not remember Andy? Like a cute little waddle that he would have. He was very social, and yeah, anytime you went over, I feel like he looked right at you and he engaged with you. He wasn't, yeah, the most colorful bird, but you could just tell he was like a kind, a kind soul. His keeper referring to him as the gentle giant. It's easy to get people to fall in love with giant pandas or, you know, elephants or something like that, but vultures are a bit of a tougher, a tougher sell. Now, seeing this bronze memorial come to life, it's bittersweet for Helen. It's because he's not here, and I would take him back in a minute and not do the sculpture, but, you know, here we are. We're just hanging out. But she knows he does live on, and we want him to live on. He'll always be an ambassador. We want him to continue to inspire um, caring and compassion for his wild relatives. Because legacies don't end. Tracy Avery says the statue should cost around $40,000. They hope to have it installed in a few months, maybe early June. They've been posting a lot of progress on their Instagram account. If you want to learn more or if you'd like to donate, head to our news app. Amanda Gilbert, KUTV, 2 News.